Hello and welcome back to another episode of Jagged Alliance 3 or as some of my friends would uh, say Check the Lions uh, 3. Anyways, we are definitely going to continue this wonderful playthrough. We have uh, gotten ourselves a big fat diamond mine the last time and we're sort of okay with finances. You can see that <clears throat> we're getting enough to just barely scrape by. But it's not really enough to fill our pouches, so I want a second mine. Uh, the last thing that uh, I mentioned is we're going to hire and train up militia. We did exactly that. And if you're looking at our current squad, I renewed all of the contracts. With the exception of Grizzly. And I'm wondering if I should renew his contract. Or if we want to go to someone else. So let's maybe start with mercenary info. I wasn't that impressed by Grizzly, mainly because he has not, I mean, he hasn't necessarily done anything wrong, but he does have a quite skewed profile in terms of a low amount of dexterity, which is not really helpful for kind of overwatch shots. And that's what I originally wanted him to do. Then on top of it, he does have melee attacks. I don't want him to be John Rambo that goes in with melee attacks. And we don't really have a lot of heavy weapons at the moment. So I scoured the database a bit for other recruits. So generally speaking, I considered uh, exchanging Livewire for uh, Kalina. I think Kalina is maybe the easier and better uh, starting character, but with a wisdom score of 48 versus big fat uh, 95, I'm pretty sure that over time Livewire will outgrow that problem. She does have already uh, 76 marksmanship, which if we are looking at her actual profile, See, she got plus five from training. So we just need to spend some more time training. I think the training overall, field experience, she's learning a lot and she's a very, very quick study, which I like. So that is hence why I kept her. We would have Steroid as a frontliner as well uh, with his unarmed strike. He fills the same spot as Igor, so but Igor does have Vozhny Zudovnia and that makes him not only more cool but in my perspective also much easier to play with because we do have grit and grit is good and I want to uh, really use him as the frontliner so as time goes by he needs to uh, get all of the nice little talents that give him grit Barry not even a discussion and MD I think he's, has done a really good job. Uh, his medical skills are phenomenal. His marksman is getting up there, so it's getting better. Which means I am thinking about what to do with Livewire. Uh, she has too little hit points to be in the, fr uh, in the front, so we need to continue um, using her as a sniper. Uh, I like her inside um, ability, that is good. I also like her um, ability to swap weapons whenever needed. That is uh, that is fantastic. So she's actually not a bad character, uh, all things con uh, considered. She's just not really that good at fighting and at sniping, but that might uh, become better over time. I just need to give her time. So back to my original point, Grizzly. Grizzly was supposed to fulfill the role of an AK wielding um, really Hard, uh, hard hitting mercenary, but his dexterity makes that a bit more difficult. And I looked at other options. Um, we uh, would have Orem here. Orem feels more like a um, Overwatch uh, guru with his uh, eyes on the back, which is kind of a uh, 3D Overwatch. I think he ca could really be a great uh, addition to the team. Pin down doesn't uh, look too bad as well, but overall he still has the same problem with dexterity. I don't understand why why the they would give him Overwatch, but then a low dexterity. Um, that really doesn't uh, make a lot of sense. Mouse seems fine from the stats. The stats are looking good. 
I like the Overwatch area movement uh, that she does uh, that she has, um, but she falls on the same problem a bit too little uh, to hit. And then we do a Fox. Fox seems really good with uh, Dexterity, but we already have uh, someone who can heal. As a matter of fact, with uh, Lifewire, we do have two people um, who can heal. So I went one tier up and thought, hmm, well, what can what what could we get for our money? Grunty, uh, not only because he's a German, but also because he seems like a really decent soldier. Is a good all-arounder and he has decent stats here, but unfortunately that comes at the extent of a lot of his physical uh, physical stats. His um, special ability attacks the closest enemy with the firearm when the combat starts. Seems good, but that requires him to kind of be a pistol uh, wielder, uh, which then is interesting because he also has heavy weapons. Yeah, well, but this here could uh, be used with machine guns, apparently. He definitely has the right traits, is buffed up and so on, so it's good. Uh, he might be an option. Bunce uh, has uh, an, an accuracy bonus against uh, allies that have been hit, uh, against enemies that have been hit this turn. I like the distracting shot, that's good. High wisdom, uh, that is really, really good. Good dexterity, just a poor strength. So that would be okay. She definitely would be okay. Meltdown comes with a lot of extra traits. The last enemy to attack Meltdown is marked with, with vengeance. So that sort of makes her a, a really good kind of frontliner. I like that she has decent stats. Not outrageously good, but decent. All, uh, all along and she really has um, a, a few good stats uh, there as well. Uh, Blood Henderson looked fine with his uh, throwing knives but we already have someone with throwing knives so I, I will pass on that this time. And then the last one that we could theoretically buy is Ice and that got me thinking that guy really looks good. So first of all stats all high 80s wisdom um, with 80 is the lowest stat, but 80 is still pretty damn good he is a stat monster no explosives no medical okay by uh, fine by me we don't need that we do have medicals um, mechanical fine that's uh, that can always be helpful to repair stuff decent leadership and almost 90 marksmanship that is great and he has a cool ability. Fire several uh, shots aimed at leg, groin, torso, hands and head. And I figured, hmm, uh, if we would combine that with a, an automatic weapon, then that would be quite painful uh, for the enemy. Reduced accuracy penalty when using burst fire full auto. Dodges first successful attack and is a nice little uh, flank, uh, flanker. So he seems to be kind of an agile uh, character. And remember that we didn't really have an agility based character. So he with his high agility and high dexterity uh, could be not necessarily an overwatcher, but more kind of a skirmisher. And that is something that I could uh, consider. He is expensive. But if we hire him, where do we want to put him? Savannah Hill. Where is Flag here? Oh, uh, no. We want Village of Ernie. And we're going there as well. But before we're going, Grizzly leaves us. Then I would like Grizzly to hand over a couple of his items. Thank you for your service. Armor is gone. And AK, and that is gone as well.
Good, we're really low on funds now. Whilst we're waiting, let's train our mercenaries and I think it's fair to say that a little bit more accuracy could go a long way. all your valuables no close okay cool wait, wait wait what is this red line here these guys will attack when will they come how long will that take I mean, we could land here, right? And intervene. Eight enemies. We do have eight veteran defenders. How long will it take? Uh, time remaining seven days. Okay, well that is enough time for us to go down here. Anyways, ICE is with us, which means we're managing squads. ICE is supposed to be with the others. Um, one topic that I would say is we could use someone with medical experience a bit further at the front line. So Barry and Igor, I think would make sense to train them in medicine as well we got a stash here in the sector and we can put a couple more weapons into that stash so first and foremost ice welcome to the team great to have you let's give him the equipment and at least everybody now has a normal vest on that is not too bad ice needs guns lots and lots of guns and i like the combination of an mp40 to move and uh, then the ak to shoot i would give him a modified ak though if we have one no i think we don't Got two snipers, that's fine. Um, I tell you what, we can scrap this one here. Yes. Shotgun can go to here. Okay. So, I'm wondering. The Famas is still a good weapon. Unload and reload. How much ammunition do we have? Not a lot is the big problem. Not a lot of um, ammunition. As long as we don't have better or more ammo for for the famous i wonder if it's really worth uh, holding on onto it could keep it in in our backpack but yeah hmm. it's fine good how long does it take to go over here because we want to go to the port and then want to get the mine there that'll be one day over the water all right let's go no 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 no, no. Uh, canceling the operation first okay 
Port Cacao, here we come. Oh, nice. There is a diamond uh, shipment right there. Nine enemies. Well, I think it's fair to say that we will fight. We got Fog. What does Fog do? Hmm. I assume range attacks are not as accurate. Something along those lines. Okay, we got a huge harbor here. Many, many different ships. And apparently a city. Big building, another big building. Kind of slums here. Okay, well. Putting the team down and Hello, let's explore. Oh wow, we already find enemies. Interesting, good. Can we somehow get on top? Oh yeah, we can. Trying to be quiet. Ready to go unnoticed, yeah? Cool. Okay, the four others. Okay. Go in. Still undetected. Need to move up. Quiet. Moving quietly. Um Did I tell you? Igor can move together with Barry. There is an enemy over here. Okay, interesting. I will try to become hard to see. Going. Still undetected. Device disarmed with precision. Um, look quietly. Like this? Okay, we already know there is one enemy back what? there. Okay, well, it was just a matter of time. Intruder's alarm is what he shouts. Well, ready. That won't help you, my friend. Target locked. We're hiding here. Uh, I was never good at hide and seek. Good odds, I believe. Into the hat. Oh, 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 99. Holy. Eyes still hidden. Might as well overwatch here. Better to go unnoticed, yeah? This is always the best way to do things. Good, we're go uh, we're laying low. Just in case someone comes from here. Honestly, I do not feel it is fair to make me watch over everyone. And we got ourselves balance weight. Can be combined with a melee weapon. Increased bonus from aiming. Okay, that's something for better melee weapons. Moving toward destination. Okay, moves out. Yes, yes. just in case someone comes out. We're going to wait. So, 
Where is good old Igor? Oh, Igor is also inside. Don't like that. I do it. Igor moves up and stays there. Okay. Okay, so what are we going to do? Um, a bit of Dashvidonia and a kill. And Igor is fine, good. Very nice. So where is Hello. Barry? Over here. He'll see Gore. I will do. I will try to MD. Can you please get up here? To be quiet. Enemy pull. Okay, Igor. I sneak up. I Igor will do a nice little attack. Prepare a takedown. No. Alright, come on. Come a little bit closer. Uncle Ivan would be proud. Decent chance given they don't see me. Wow, this weapon is good. They cannot hit what they cannot see. This would be pointless. Nice. Can't you ever saw me? Moving quietly. I will move silently. I will shoot at enemy when available. I'm a sort of cold. How's where where how could I do that? Okay, that is the the, spe, the special graced. Oh, he's already down. Never mind. On the down low. Going. Still undetected. Cool, very good. Uh, unload lots and lots of ammunition. Quietly. Let us see what the Lord in his wisdom oh, has. Oh, perfect. Passed. Three grenades. The Lord in his wisdom has definitely given us three massive grenades. Did I tell you? I am great at hiding. What? Yes. Follow Igor. 
Good. Everybody, just move up here for now. Let's bounce. Like sneak up. Hide again. This is a much more controlled place, though. You heard about that little shit, Pierre? The major promoted him to a shovel boy in Diamond Ray. Really? Damn it. I'm signing up for a ship there. I'll show Mr. I'm too good for you exactly what he's good for. Good luck with that. There is already a waiting list of 60 something, me included. I move in hiding. Playing it smooth. Got the angle to do this quiet and quick. Nice. I just killed him. Bad dude spotted me. Almost dead, okay. That's a really poor place to hide, my friend. Okay, I don't know where the last enemies are. I move in hiding. I do not know what it is, but we should probably take it just in case we need it. We're not going to loot anything for now. We're going to check out the city afterwards. If I recall correctly, we fought, uh, we were up against nine. Killed four in the harbor, plus one, plus three. It's two. Hmm. We actually should already be done. Says there are still hostiles in this area. This is always the best way to do things. Going. Still undetected. Enemy ho! I will move silently. No problem. I will try to become hard to see. Moving. Huh? In my sight. Moving quietly. Conflict resolved. Okay, so that was the last guy. That's not technically stealing if no one is around to call it that. Uh, when this falls apart, it won't come off my salary, right? Cool. Go for glory. Actually, quite happy how that worked. I think that was the first time Fine. that I could properly use sneak. Let's bounce. Starting to get the hang of it. How can I assist? We have agreement. Two more hand grenades. Very Fabulous. Ready to um that do shot. stuff. Okay. Come with me, everyone. Okay, we had more loot here. Hello. I will go presently. We have agreement. Very good. I will do. Moving toward destination. Ready. Locked. Locked. Okay, we don't need a crowbar. We just need. Keeping it real. We just need. How can I assist? Some good lock picking here. There we go. TNT. The go-to for railroad builders and Wild West uh, villains. I like it. And proximity detonator. Well, take a wild guess. Who's going to work with that? Exactly. Good old Barry. Good, 45 points of damage, that's not bad. Do we have, still have the remote detonator? Yes, we do. Even better.
Okay, crafting materials go over to Hogbite now. Large blast area, okay. Sure. All we need to do is find good uh, situations where we will use the TNT. Um, Yeah, at the moment I do have the have basic idea. bitch standard grenades uh, for Barry. Let's take a big tour through the city and explore a little bit what we're going to find here. It, I would assume a lot of loot and a couple of conversations. Yes. I will go presently. Hmm. Nothing, really. Moving as of this moment. Hello. Hi. Sure. Okay. Right We're moving? We're moving. That's useful, right? <laughs> Well, fantastic. The I one time that we do not have Barry available. Yes. We have agreement. Hello. Hi. Ah, I think Here. I could have Get looted there. that. Heading out. But there seems oh. to be a lot in here. Molotov cocktails. I was wondering when we would find some Hello. of them. They were definitely a staple in Jack the Lions too. Let's see what we found. We could always use more meds. Bags of chicken francs. A whole bag of local currency, almost like real money. Spotted a thing that wants an investigate. Sure, Igor Dolch, ready. Okay, thousand two hundred fifty and five hundred. Cool. Some more money, that's helpful. That was good loot. Word up. Dying in bed is for losers. Dying in bed is for losers, okay. We outy. Some stuff over there. Word up. How can I assist? Moving toward destination. What? We'll do. Affirmative. Cool. More of that fake local currency. Sure. And we got a revolver with a modification on it. Uh, what exactly is the modification? Shorter range, decreased uh, reliability, decreased AP costs when attacking. Interesting. I think we're scrapping it because I'm really not in the mood uh, for pistols. Going. I might be doing them wrong, Ready. but they, so far they have not con convinced me at all. I have found a thing. Hackable device? Oh yeah. Um, we're going right. Hey. 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 Headshot you. Up. Ain't never seen you here before. You like to gamble? Yeah, I bet you love it. They call me Headshot Hugh. Uh, you can call me Headshot or Hugh. Just don't call me Head Hulk. That shit ain't funny. Yeah, it's a wild story, man. I got shot in the head and survived. What? Now I got this hole that goes right through my brain. It's crazy. 
You for real? Or are you playing? It's the street dope. You don't believe me, do you? Come on. Bet some money, and I'll show you. Nah, we don't have money left over. Come on. And I don't want to gamble. Put your head. No, we're playing an honest, uh, an honest playthrough. Gambling sure. is not part of our attire. They got great at spotting things. Something over there. What? Sure. Who the fuck are you? <laughs> what the fuck you want? <laughs> uh, we're mercenaries. But I didn't think you were fucking tourists. What the fuck you want, mercenaries? Uh, what do we mean? I really do not understand the hostility. We have not done anything bad to you. I would know if we did. Well, fuck. Don't take a grand's mouth so serious, sweetheart. I mostly save it for the men. <laughs> I did not mean the way that sounded. Anyway, it's just the way I fucking talk. Who are you? Granny, granny, for fuck's sake. Everyone knows me. Back when I was in the coffee beans gang, mothers used my fucking name to scare children who misbehaved. Coffee beans? The toughest fucking gang in town. In our day, we hung out at the right bar. Good old Ma Baxter ran it back then. She was slapping a fucker who wanted to start shit. But now, she's giving hell only to the devil. And a dumb son is running the bar. Uh, are you selling guns? No, I'm giving them for sentimental reasons. Of course, I'm fucking selling the fucking guns. Ooh. Oh, I'm just fucking teasing. Take a look and see if you can find something you like. Just don't resell anything. You don't sell to the Fuck Legion? No. No guns for those fucking rapey summer robbers. They only get bullies from me. For free. If you know what I mean. Are you planning to do something about their fucking in-night operation? Or are you going to let the fucking Legion take over my fucking docks? Uh, in-night? Come on. Even the fucking people on the street know about the Legion's grand fucking operation. Those fuckers can't keep a secret even if their fucking lives depend on it. Which happens to be the case. I plan to swarm the place in a few days. See? I even marked the end night date on my calendar. Well, look at that. I got me a party to crash. Ooh. Can the coffee beans help us? I'd be happy to see the old guy together again. But, well, let's say we did not part on the best of terms. If I tried to talk to Kyle, Wilma, Kayla, Wuchudi, Old Vinny, or especially Madonna. They would likely be. Perhaps you can convince those fucked up Olags to help fight off the Legion. Okay. Good. Goodbye. Well, we got a city to defend. A thing that wants an investigate. So, what do we have? Buy modified Effen Fell for 2500. We got a farmer's here. Effen Fell, I think, was an assault rifle. Uh, buy three high explosive grenades for a thousand. Buy a modified RPK 74 for three thousand. That is, I think, a real machine gun. Buy heavy armor for a thousand. Okay, this is a no brainer. Purchased heavy armor. Lovely. Berry. There you go. Arms torso and um, body parts only torso and this here is arms as well. Okay, well in that case we definitely want arms. Body parts, arms, torso, arms, torso, arms, torso. Okay. Okay.
Good. So, how much money do we have? 7,000. Are we wanting a modified FN fell for 2,5? And a modified RPK for 3? Hmm. Let's test the F and Fall. I want to see how good these weapons are. Okay, F and Fall. High damage, faster condition loss, and what are the modifications here? If your first attack is an attack, counts as being aimed three times. Okay. Moderate accuracy. Oh, that's actually quite, quite good. Um, three times 15. Hogbind has 4 times 11, 44, and that is 45. But this one here does still have a tripod and so on. The F and Fall isn't bad at all. Made to standard R ammunition, that's the only problem. It again uses the same ammunition that we always use. It's a really good weapon. Um, yeah, this one here is still a bit better due to its attachments, but I definitely want to keep that F and foul. That's a good one. Okay, and if that one was so good, how good is the RPK for 3000? Okay, RPK. What kind of ammunition does this one you uh, need? Okay, that's Warshaw packed ammunition. That's good. That's very good. Bursts, long fire, and full auto. Increase AP size when reloading, but increase clip size. Look, that's not bad at all. I think this is an actual proper machine gun. Based on Warshaw packed ammunition. So for Hogby, that's the exact weapon that I would want. Okay. Uh, then he can switch to the M14 whenever he feels that that is needed. Okay. Yeah, I don't regret uh, buying either of these weapons. They were actually... No, 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 no. Going. Okay, we don't want to buy Ready. grenades. Okay. It's the only thing that I don't want to buy. They are okay, but sure. we'll with our free shaped charges, we don't need to buy grenades. Oh. Probably check this out, right? Let's move. Okay. Yes, go. Okay, we now need to take a look at this. We now need to start talking oh, to all of them. Show me some <laughs> the ice is funny, show me some blinks. 
Uh, I start digging his vi uh, vibe. Root Trudy. Um, who's also Root? Yeah, certainly not Livewire. Uh, yes. How about Hogbite? Fuck you! Fuck! Alright, you got my fucking attention. I'll go talk to Gran if it will get you the fuck out of my face. We outy. On our way. Good. One done. Sure. We'll get there. Fine. Fine. Well, the others. Okay, here's another one. So bossy. Gal Wilma. Ice here. Let's try. Uh, let's try oh. ice. Gran only wants to see me so she can tease me about my height some more. I don't have to put up with her teasing. It's not my. I don't have leadership. To okay, teasing. we need leadership here. My fault that both of my legs are shit. I don't have to put up. With Shite, don't have we don't have enough teasing. leadership. I think that's the only stat uh, that we do not have like 80 plus. We will do. Of course. Very under. Parry this. Oh, quit crying. It's just a scratch. So old Gran wants my help cutting up some Legion boys. Count me in. Well, thank you, Granny, for just hitting us. What a stupid old lady. How can I assist? Word up. Okay. Presently in attendance. Live wire here. On our way. With certainty. Mad Hannah, Mad okay. Unga. What? Speak the fuck up or get blown the fuck up. I have many explosives on my person. They do not respond. What? Speak louder for fuck's sake. All right, all right. <laughs> they are all a little bit crazy. I will do. How can I assist? We're moving? Okay, one, two, three, They're four. Moving. I think we got all oh of them God. short of one. Good to see you, Hannah. I can't wait for the fucking leisure. Uh. Okay, did we forget one? Oh, yeah. Of course. There's an old Winnie with a heavy on, right. machine gun. Well, that is something that Talkbite should talk about. Medical check failed. Good, got ourselves some uh, armor here. And since this is a town, we got a stash. That's what I was hoping for. Great, so we can stash some items here. Pistols, armor, a crowbar, a normal AK. Good, how many days do we have? Uh, four days? Then we need to defend the sector here, and then we need to immediately get up and defend the other sector. So I would say what we still need is monies. So off we go in the next episode into this mine over here. The port Cacao could definitely do with some more liberation, so I would like to liberate this sector here and then be back in time. Uh, when the city is being attacked. All right, that's it for today, guys. Appreciate your viewership as always. If uh, you take a glance at the like button, 
try to aim three times like you do it in this game and give it a salvo. Let me know if you hit it and see you in the next episode. Bye bye.